yellow. I was literally driving over that bridge. There are no instructions about parking. Yo, oh, Sana, I feel like crying. Oh, this is stressful. Imagine driving like for so long and now you have to suffer like this. Turn left onto Cape Road, R102. to my channel good morning i am on my way to cape town join me at the roundabout take the first exit guys this is exciting i've been wanting to do this um for a very long time and this is a perfect opportunity to do it Go so guys join me one hour and 52 minutes to enter on my journey to Cape Town, let's go! You guys, I just drove over that bridge just now. Wow. 
this is really beautiful look how deep this valley is so the tallest bungee jump in the world is somewhere close by Oh, before we go guys, I just want to see, I have to see what's down there. It looks really cool. Let's go together. I need to use my time wisely. another spot where you can look down this is beautiful I can't even see the bottom Whoa. I was literally driving over that bridge let's go guys <laughs> we don't have much time So we're gonna drive for another I think it's 100 kilometers and then we will reach our destination <laughs> not really our destination is still very far away let me see if I can go back through these bushes stay on the natural path because if you don't you're gonna get stuck Ugh. get me now wasting more time so I've been here before I've been here once I uh, was with my colleagues who were going to Blatt Blatt and Naisna Blattenberg Bay and Naisna I took some videos and even today I haven't posted any of them um, <laughs> maybe I will gain courage to edit those videos because you they're all over the place and the phone I was using wasn't proper so yeah we'll see we'll see when the day that day comes we'll just see them uploaded so guys let's continue with our journey yo yo guys I don't know what I did with my uh, map um it kind of exited and now my uh salty data is not working at all and i can't access my gps so i'm trying to use my vodacom yay vodacom has connected and we're back on we're back on the road we're back on the road so guys the plan was actually for me to fly but my boss came with this idea he asked me if i would like to drive and i say why not <laughs> why not because i literally have never completed the garden route so having to start with it in pe all the way to cape town it's something really special so this is um some sort of um uh road trip but it's actually for work but I will try to enjoy as much of it as I can. I'll get to my other break stop in an hour. So in an hour, I will rest again. So guys, let's go. Let's go. 
I'm glad that I had a backup. I had I have two networks with me, Vodacom and Salsi. Imagine if I just had one. You I'll be doomed. So guys, the journey starts again. Let's go. I don't know where to face this camera. I think I should just face it to the road. Because that's what is more interesting. I believe. In 100 meters, turn right onto NT. Okay, we're going back to the N2, to the highway. Woo. Turn right onto NT. Thank you. And here we leave again. Off we go. We've officially entered Western Cape, guys. We are in Western Cape. And we are on a road that is leading to George. George, George, George. Woohoo! This is exciting. Honestly speaking, this is the reason why I chose to drive because I really enjoy long distance drives if I'm doing it myself. Because I mean, if, it, if I'm in a bus, usually I'll just slip the entire way. <laughs> You've seen my videos where I was vlogging uh, while in a bus. Most of, the, most of the journey, I was sleeping. So guys, enjoy the ride with me to the road. driving on this windy windy road and the speed limit is 80 this road is very close to the ocean on my gps i can see the sea very very close on our left hand side and i think we are approaching flat Plattenberg bay Woohoo! i can see the ocean my word God's creation is perfect there eh? it's beautiful so guys we are about to cross a river mouth I think it's a river 
come out the bridge I see a bridge we're almost there hope you guys are gonna be able to see this Ooh, this is beautiful sorry you're not gonna be able to see the sides
nice now guys we're passing nice now
guys look at those houses that are like built on the side of that that uh, mountain they look so cool but I'm sure they're getting lots of noise from the cars that are passing here Guys, we are halfway to Cape Town and I'm like so oily. Oof, it's hot, 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 hot. So I just want to go out there and uh, use the bathroom. Oof. And I'm not feeling very well. Uh, my body feels like I'm about to get some flu. Oof. Yeah, I am hungry. Maybe I should go get something proper to eat. So I just had breakfast. I feel a lot better. Sometimes you feel like you're sick. All you have to do is just to eat and then you, you're gonna feel much better. So guys, we are about to leave Mosul Bay right now. We are continuing with our journey. I'm just not sure about my fuel, if it's gonna take me all the way to Cape Town. Let me show you guys. Oh, but one thing that i know for sure is that there are so many um filling stations along this end too so i'm hoping i'm hoping that i'm not gonna run out of fuel in the middle of nowhere so guys let's continue with the journey yeah let's go i'm not 
not sure which town this is uh, but um, I feel like it's a good sign I can see this big mountain I think it's part of the table mountain I'm not sure what it's called here uh, you guys in what's the name of this town I'm trying to see if there's any board that says something about this place but it looks like a nice place as well Western Cape is beautiful guys We barely made it. We are at the garage and the car, it's like, yo, oh. <laughs> this is risky. I'm not gonna do this again. Whenever I say garage, even if I still have enough, I'm just gonna fill up. Cause if I run out and I'm still far from, from the garage, yo.
What's this place? What are these people here for? They, they are fresh um, roaster cooker. It's eating stuff inside. Oh, they okay. Yes, they can go eat nice coffee, everything inside. I see. That's why it's Yo, there's so many of these people walking in, guys. They look like school kids. They're definitely school kids. Just not sure where they're coming from. Oh, they're going to a bus. Okay, let me open for you. <sighs> They're probably on a school outing. Whew, I'm still alive, guys. I think that breakfast and coffee gave me energy. Because, yo, I wasn't doing so well. I was tired, feeling sick. I, I still feel like I'm getting flu, but I'm a lot better. I've been singing the whole way. <laughs> I couldn't record, record that. <laughs> it's only meant for me and my God, not for anybody else. Mm. Uh, I that. Oh, okay. I think it's full, isn't it full? Yo, I love my tank, eh? Yeah. Eight something. <laughs> Smaller. <laughs> it doesn't take you far. <laughs> yeah. So my full tank is like eight something. That's your window. Okay. So I brought fruits. I brought fruits for lunch. Maybe I should just drink water. No, this one is not open.
guys the air is so dirty here from a distance i thought it was um like the same thing as like fog from the sea but yo something is burning somewhere and it stinks i'm not sure what exactly is happening i see breakdowns uh, you see those big vehicles like the fire fighting vehicles i see them on the other road the opposite road maybe there is an accident something exploded oh no it is an accident oh no oh no mm. oh my god it's an accident oh, the vehicle was carrying alcohol lots of alcohol I'm not sure if you guys were able to you to see that but the smoke is definitely not coming from the accident it's like everywhere people who stay in Cape Town why why is this smoke here what is something burning or there is like factories this is so weird to have so much smoke everywhere you can't even tell where exactly it's coming from In, in a very short space of time so far this is the third one
Yo guys, clash work, it's, it's, <laughs> it's, it's a job and a half. In the traffic, yo, clash balance, hey. Ay, ay, ay. I love manual cars, but on traffic, uh -uh. <laughs> it doesn't make sure. It does not make sure at all.
in 600 meters. Turn right onto Adderley Street. Yo, the homelessness here. Oh my word! Unfortunately, my camera is tied. You can't. You won't be able to see it. But yo, it's on another level. So guys, we are three minutes away from the accommodation. I hope they are expecting me. In 300 meters, turn right onto Adderley Street. Guys, this is Cape Town. We are here. It looks different. So different from what I'm used to, you know. The only big city I've ever seen is um, Joburg and Pretoria. So, <laughs> this is a bit different. It's a little bit like PE, but on a bigger scale. Am I here? Is this the place? Oh, it's further in front. Let's go further in front. All of a sudden, I'm so nervous. I think it's because yo, <laughs> it's it's downtown, and downtowns um, in many places are usually rough. And also, I don't know how to. You've arrived at your destination. Oh, what am I gonna do? Yo, guys, I am exhausted. I called the lady. She said that she's gonna send someone to come fetch me. She asked for for my details, my number plate, the description of my car. And I've been waiting for like <laughs> a long time. So now I have to make a plan. I'm not even sure this is the right thing. Can you even? Can you even drive here? Oh, this is ridiculous.
JP. I lost. I'm looking for this parking, but I don't know how to get in. Uh, I'm. Uh, will you please talk to this lady for me? Yo, 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 the person that you sent didn't arrive, but I just drove around in search of the place and I think I found it, but I don't know what to do here at the entrance, like in order to get in. Which entrance are you? Are you at the parking entrance that I sent you? The two the yes. pictures of the parking? Yes, I finally okay, found you it. Need to tell, you need to tell security that you're going in, you're going to Blackrick. Okay, okay, he's actually listening to you. Okay, that's oh. all. You're going to be checking in at Blackbird. It's you Megan speaking. Am I also at security? security? So, he, the security here at the entrance is saying that no, you should I'm call. You should call security. He's saying that you should call the security for Black Briggs. Like the security here at the entrance. Okay. Wow, this is very disappointing. I will call them now. Okay. Okay, thank you. Bye. Bye. In Zim. Julian. Okay. Thank you. Oh my word, I'm too far. You said? I'm what are you? Yeah, I'm just you're exhausted. I've been trying to get help from, from the whoever is in charge. It's impossible. Where, where do I go? Okay. Thank you. Instructions, nothing. This is stressful. Did I miss something on the emails? Did she say something specific? Like instructions?
There are no instructions about parking. Yo, Sana, I feel like crying. Yo, this is stressful. Imagine driving like for so long and now you have to suffer like this. Hi, I'm in the parking now, but I can't find where exactly I'm supposed to go. Um, the security people just said that I should just go up and I have no idea where. Ugh, I'm tired. Woo. Guys, finally, we have arrived. We found the place after waiting for hours. Phew, you're, I am very tired. I'm exhausted. Tired, it is, it is an understatement. <sighs> My goodness. Oh, we are here. This is the room. It doesn't have a stove, so I won't be able to cook. And uh, it has a place to work. If you want to do some editing and whatever, you can do it here. And the bed looks like this. <laughs> I always avoid this kind of headboards. Look, this is a hand. This is a hand. Who knows what it was doing there? and there's a big TV I don't have much of a view because we are not up there all we are looking at oh, <laughs> it's these buildings so the whole time I was waiting down there there, 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 there oh. while well, my room is actually here <sighs> Now I can breathe, I can lie down, breathe. I can call my mom. She's been trying to get hold of me. I hope she's not panicking. Uh, let me give her a call to let her know that I'm here. I've arrived safely. I think the drive was the most beautiful I've ever done. What do you think? Comment down below. Stay tuned for more Cape Town videos.